we live, Jeffrey? Rock and roll. Let's rock this thing out. Let's go with it now. Like we always do, we kind of wing it here, but you've, all, you've seen this guy in a lot of the videos. He's driving the boat, usually. But John was a mate for a long time. Night Lines with O.B. O'Brien. In the 80s. In the 80s, trolling St. Thomas. Anyway, the rigs we're going to talk about, and I don't even know what the name of the rig we came up with was, but I had never seen this. And it, like, when I saw John do it, I'm like, that is the most simple thing I had ever seen. For sure. And let me take the two pick out. Um, <laughs> that is like the most simple rig I've ever seen, but yet I've never seen anybody use that. It's awesome. Simple. Awesome. It's great. So, so, so again, um, we go fishing the other day. John says, I, I'll rig the baits. We're going dolphin fishing. We're going across to the, to, to the pocket or the, mm -hmm. the uh, channel and we're fishing for mahi. And so he shows up with these baits and leaders, there's no leader. So there's a, there's a rig, a swivel, and you're gonna, we're gonna, so you understand he's gonna rig these for you. But for the explanation of what I saw, there was a strip rig, there was a ballyhoo rig, and there was no swivels up on the line. You wound the fish right to the, right to the boat. We catch up, check these two, here's the rigs anyway that we were fishing, check this out. Take a look at it on the screen. So th those are the same. These are actually the same exact rigs that we were fishing that day. Now take a look at the size of the dolphin we were catching. Slobs. We caught a couple slobs. Um, super slammers, John. Super slammers they were. They were. They were awesome off, fish. Very nice. You know, I mean, seeing them under the weed line. For sure, catching it was them. great. But you, th these are the actual rigs and rods we used. Wind on leader. John, talk about the rig a little bit. You know, we're going to go into it. He's going to rig it, so you don't need to really see it yet. But talk about the simplification of the rig. Like, what, what, what was yeah, the thought? Yeah, it's basically a wind-on leader. We tried to do away with leaders in our bait box. You want to rig whatever it may be, two or three dozen baits for a day of fishing. Of course, you have two or three dozen leaders in your bait box at that point. You reaching in the bait box and fumbling around when things start happening and you start to get into this few fish and invariably your leaders are mixed up, tangled up. I might have coiled the leaders up and in excitement telling you to grab a leader, I'll coil it righty, your lefty, whatever it may be, go right. to uncoil the leader and you've got nothing but a big mess to do. Follow deal with. what he just said, so, like, which is really, really the thing. This is, that's, this it, is the I coil a certain way, you coil a certain sure. way, and when, we, and when the shit hits the fan right. and we got dolphin behind the boat, I can't coil it this, uh, uncoil it the same way. So you got a mess and no bait to throw to the fish, basically. Right. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so talk about the wind on. Like, this, we, we fished a wind on. Yeah, that's it, 60 pound. Um, 60 pound Andy is our wind on. Uh, 30 pound, uh, I believe it's suffix is our main line, and we double the suffix a couple of feet and add about 20 feet of the 60 pound Andy for our wind on. And that's it. We basically rig our baits on swivels with no leaders to put in a bait box. There's no confusion, no leaders to deal with. Um, very simple. When you get a fish up to the boat, you don't need a wire man. You can do it yourself. You can catch a real big fish by yourself, wind him up to the boat. Okay, he's close enough. Reach for the gaff. Gaff him rather than, uh-oh, now I have a 10-foot leader to deal with. Great. There's none of that. Wind the fish up, gaff him, done. Good to go. It was, it was as simple as that. I never really, th I mean, I kind of consider myself decent when it comes Absolutely. to thinking about stuff, but, yeah. and, and, but quite frankly, that was so simplified. And, and, and to look at the product, okay, yeah, you're, you're talking it. about when I look at this ballyhoo, and you get, we're going to rig this in a second. This is a swimmer. It's a pin rig. Um, but here's your swivel at the top. If I squeeze that and you're looking at the swivel on the bait, now all you're doing is tying it to this wind-on leader. Tie it to your leader. Um, 